Hello, Carolina Girl Who Report followers. We are here at Julius Chambers High School, uh, the week of the 4A state championship. We have with us Chambers head coach, Donnell Ryan. Coach Ryan, thank you for joining us. Thank you for coming, sir. Always a pleasure, man. You opened up the door for me uh, the last couple of years to come out here and watch your teams, you know, make this big run, obviously. Being the, 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 the 4A state champion the last two years, you're looking to make history this year. Your team's been up and down this year, had a couple of rough losses in the regular season, but you're able to bounce back, win the conference championship, make this run through the playoffs. Let's talk about this season. Uh, you're 23-6. and six. Uh, You were the number six seed. What were some of the things you learned about your team this year that's going to help you, obviously, close out this season with a championship? Well, I learned a lot about my kids' personalities. Uh, I know people say you can coach everybody the same, but you're going to have to bend a little bit because of people's personalities, the way they handle coaching. So I always say you can treat everybody right, but you can't treat them all alike. So that's what I learned about my team. Um, I can yell and scream at some, and I can't yell and scream at others. Some want you to talk to them and coach them through things as they're going through it. Some people want to know what's going to happen when they get there. So that's one of the biggest components I took from the season. Now, there was a turnover on the roster. Obviously, you have a lot of kids coming up from JV, a lot of kids you know, coming back home to go to school here from other schools this year. You lost uh, over the last two years, the two state championship teams, you lost about 10 kids that are all, the majority of them playing in college right now. Mm -hmm. um, this group obviously has an identity on the defensive side. You know what I'm saying? They really love, they love to play defense, probably more than anything else, but more than taking shots. <laughs> <laughs> you know, so, but but that is something that I know that you really, really teach and love about this group. Um, mm -hmm. Going into the state playoff, the state championship game, you're going up against um, who is going to most likely be the state player of the year. She's been carrying her team all year. Indian Nivar has been playing really, really well. Um, can you give me an idea of what you've seen on film and what you see from her that is going to give you some fits on the defensive side? Well, she can score on all three levels. Uh, she handled the ball well. She sees the court. She includes her teammates in the game. So what I see with her is just try to slow her down as much as you can. I don't think anyone can stop her, but we're just going to try to contain her as much as possible and make some of the other players beat us. I know we've been, we've been talking offline a little bit. I know you've been watching, 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 trying to gather as much film as you possibly can. Yes, <laughs> she, she, she's a load. Obviously, she's heading out to Stanford. Um, you know, just a great, great young lady. Um, but let, let's talk about Saturday, you know what I'm saying? You're going in with this group, you know what I'm saying? You've got a lot of firepower. Um, Mila Holloway, your sophomore guard, I consider her probably one of the top players in the state in that class. Um, I agree. Uh, any Any – indications of, you know, is she going to be on Nivar? You know what? Let's not even talk about that. Hey, coach, <laughs> let, let, let's leave the surprises for the surprises on Saturday. Let's, <laughs> I don't want nobody to know what's going on out there. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. But um, I, I truly think that this team, you know, you've got a lot of talent. You know, obviously, with you're going to lose uh, Trinity Moreland this year. Um, you're coming back with just about everyone else. You're going to be loaded again next year. Um, all I have to say right now is congratulations, man. You, you, you've shown through, through, through adversity, through, you know what I'm saying, losing of players, all of that stuff that your coaching transcends through players, through everything. And here you are playing for a third straight state championship. Says a lot about you, says a lot about your coaching, says a lot about your ability to bring people together. Um, congratulations, good luck, and, you know, bring home that third banner. Man, I appreciate you coming out again. You've been a, a great supporter of the team, and it's good to have someone here to support your team, to put you out there, to let everybody know what's going on. And I appreciate you saying good luck, because I know dealing with this young lady over there on the other side, we're going to need it. Absolutely, Coach. All right, I'll see you. Thank you. All right, thank you.